We're at Cartolino in Mission Hills, a pretty new restaurant that opened just weeks before the pandemic hit. It's now back open for dine-in service, and the owner says he's hopeful. Anyone, when they are told their business is going to be shut down, it's probably the most fearful thing that um, you could ever be told. Chef Brad Wise owns Trust Restaurant Group. It includes Fort Oak, Rare Society, Trust, and its newest spot, Cartolino. After the pandemic hit, the doors remained closed for six weeks. Even without a pandemic, having a restaurant survive just in general is a tough thing, right? Yes, uh, obviously we all know the margins are already tight enough in the restaurant business and you go from revenue to literally zero dollars coming in the door. But since reopening for takeout in April and now for dine-in service, things are looking up with Fort Oak the busiest. One thing that caught him off guard was this. It was unexpected. Did you guys see a lot of support? So we definitely saw uh, a, 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 a different appreciation. Social media posts naming black owned businesses to support Trust Restaurant Group was on the list. You know, it, once you see yourself on that list, you know, like, OK, so people are talking, they understand and it means a lot. We have churches and, and foundations from North County calling down, buying gift cards, you know, just, you know, showing their support and guests coming only because we're, we're a black owned business. Wise is looking to the future. Hopeful tourism will eventually return to San Diego. If tourism doesn't pick up, which, you know, we're already hearing chatter um, that next year is looking good for people booking conventions and things of that nature. But time will tell, you know, until we get there, we don't know, you know, what's going to happen. And as for following the rules, he says people for the most part have been following them, wearing their masks and also social distancing.